I'll tell you that I love you tonight But I know the time on my side Why are you going? Why are you leaving so soon? Is the somewhere else that's better for you? Welcome back to my channel. If today's the first time here, I said big welcome to you. If you're a returning viewer or subscriber, thank you so much for joining. Thank you for returning back to my channel. My name is Chidema, aka Clue, and you are in my runner. So today we'll be doing something, we'll be doing a topic on fall, fall makeup. So I'll be showing you guys, I'll be telling you guys brief history. Um, I did a little bit of research about it. So before we quickly move to the video, please do um hit the subscribe button down here and um give the video a like. Comment, let me know what you think about the topic and the video and do let me know um or your own contribution about it thank you so much and we'll be moving down to the video all right we are back so the first thing i'm going to do right now is to wipe my face i do love to wipe my face because um i have oily skin of course i know that even if you don't have oily skin something i learned about your eyebrow that is very very necessary that i tell you guys about it because whenever you're doing makeup on your clients you need to actually do that so just to stop that high shine around this area of the face um the subtopic for our topic today is we're going to know the meaning of fall what is fall what is fall season then we're going to go over to the brief history of the fall season um we're going to know everything about the fall season as i mean everything that i was able to search <laughs> we're going to tell you guys the features the colors the holidays the festivals the activities that go on during the Four season so this is our number three then number four i'm going to show you i'm going to let you guys know about the makeup in four season makeups in four season there are so many makeups in four season and this has to do with the color so, so the next topic we'll be going over to is what's the difference between the four season makeup with the other makeup um the sixth one now is the products what and what are the products used during the four season i'm going to brush my eyebrows I am going to brush my eyebrows so the new technique that I learned about this is this so the technique goes like this I'm going to take my Sasha buttercup setting powder and I'm just going to use it on my eyebrows to make sure to dry every single um, oil around that area especially if you have oily skin do do this before you start off with your makeup so I'm just going to gently do this So I'm using um, Davis eye pencil in the shade 18 for my today's tutorial. And let's continue with what the hell um for makeup for season is. So for season, this is a season that comes um right after the summer and right before the winter season. If that makes sense. Okay. Um, the definition or uh, kind of or my way of defining it is that it is a season that comes that marks the transition from the summer season to the winter season. That is four. Then um, this four season is also called Atim in the North America. Please back. Um, it's originated from the Latin word. Um, I think Atum. Atum. I'm going to spell it. Actually, from the word from the old French word um, Atum Pay. I think so. I'm still going to write it down for you. You know, spell it out over here. Um, that particular word was taken from it okay um before the 16th century before the 16th century um this season was called the harvest season um it's called the harvest season because of over there and everywhere in the world i think because over here we also do the same thing it is during the time that we harvest that is the period from august to november this is actually the period where we harvest our crops something that we put on the farm for years not years for some months now so during the harvest season which is from august 
till november we harvest it and can't plant another one for the next season so we call it the um harvest season or the reaping season so this season um usually where it was called that till the uh some people living over there in america decided going to um the town instead of moving to the town they left the land work and still working for you know, office work or youth work and the rest of it is like getting cool cash and resting their body instead of toiling away their strength and their body on the farm they started resting and during that period the the name harvest and reaping it, it was lost okay it got lost <laughs> it got lost and um this happens that there's a word for it already from the greek word and from the latin word and from the um from the old french word so it all summed it up to be called atum so atum or fall season is a season that marks the transition from the summer season to the winter season so i have season. said before um this fall season actually starts from um the time from 8th of august and it ends around the time um 7th of november so to say that um in the north of america um actually of fall season starts with the september equinox that is around 21st of september to 24th of september then it ends with the winter solstice we Salty, 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 salty. I know that to be um, the season, the time in in um, whereby the days becomes shorter and the night becomes longer, or the days becomes longer and the night becomes longer. That is just the meaning. So um, the futures and holidays and festivals and the rest of it that happens. Um, during the fall season are these um, It is not a notable feature of fall season is one The shorter days and longer nights I don't know if that is evident right now in Nigeria, but for me, I've not noticed it like shorter days and longer nights <laughs> I've not really noticed the shorter days and longer nights. I've noticed longer days and shorter nights there's another feature that says it is cooler it has cooler temperature during the um fall time okay the the most i think this is where the um name fall came from the shedding of leaves um by the trees is also another feature of fall season the other feature is the variety of colors from the trees and the forest so there are so many colors that comes out around the fall time um these colors include the orange color that i can never forget the yellow color the red color the light brown dark brown the gold color the blue and red color the purple color the olive green color the gray color the beige color the dusky pink color so these are the colors that comes out during the fall season for today's makeup i don't really know what i'm going to do but i'm going to pick from any of these colors i'm going to do my makeup okay we have the festivals and the holidays that are seen during the fall season these are the thanksgiving day festival um i can still remember watching movies from foreign movies that's how we call it over here the foreign movies i would see um um i was still celebrating thanksgiving day <laughs> like a lot of things happened during thanksgiving day um this thanksgiving day comes around the second monday of october in the canada then um the fourth thursday of november in the u.s all right so um in the christian religion like my religion we have the holiday season of all saints day and all souls day okay it's around first november and second november so it falls around four season so these are the festivals that occur during four season then in india four is considered to be the preferred season for the goddess of learning which is called saraswati i don't know um the indian friends of mine that i have over here in face in um youtube please see that you help me and know and check if that is true 
I'm, I don't really know whether it's true. This is what I saw online. So this is the best period for the goddess of learning called Saraswati. And also this goddess, also known as the goddess of Atum, um, Sharada, Sharada, Sharada. Then in Asia, it also has um, an associated activity that occurs then um these activities are shared with associated with elements of metal and color of white which gave rise to the white tiger of the west mm -hmm. so atium is associated with halloween and halloween is celebrated on the october 31st that's the eve of all saints day and the halloween is more like a festival of the of the american um, I'll, I'll, be, I'll be going in details with it on my next video I think um, but I'm going to upload a video showing um, everything history brief history about Halloween the activity that goes on around this fourth season also is the major league baseball championship the world series known as the classic four so these are the activities that goes on around the fourth season topic the next topic goes to makeup in fourth season makeup in first season so what i quickly go over to with my um my eyeshadow i'm going to tell you guys about it so i'll be using my morphe um eyeshadow palette this is in the shade 35 n my thing this is where i have some colors associated with the fall i have the orange right here i have the bougandry i have the brown the brown the brown the brown I have so many other colors right here. Um, I have like two bougon. So for my transition shade, I'm going to make use of this um, bougandry shade. I don't know if it, this is purple. I'm using this color. Okay, I think it's purple. Whoa. Okay, so for the next um, shade, I'm going to go ahead and make use of a brown color. And I'm going to go over and take this orange shade to the makeup in four season. So the question goes like this. What is this makeup that I've done in four season? So the makeup done in four season is like a type of makeup done or worn during a four season. It is called fall makeup because it is special and it has special colors and techniques for it but during the fall season you cannot just go ahead and use any color of your choice you have there are some colors that are actually just made for the fall season so this is all you need to know about makeup in fall season the difference um between fall season and other makeup is that i've actually said one which is the products that we use during the fall season is different in the sense that it has more moisture added to it it is um more glossy and the rest of it just like preparing your face for that dry weather of the winter season okay so i have something written down right here about the difference um let me just read it out for you guys and we'll go ahead to finish up our makeup so the major difference is there is about four season and other makeup is the amount of products used the type of products used and the colors that are more evident in the makeups done during the fall season. In other words, makeup done in fall seasons are worn to show the fall color. There are more blusher in fall season than in other seasons, and more pigmented shadows can be used during the fall season. So we'll go over I to the products used during the fall season. But before I go over to that, um, let's finish up the makeup so okay let me just jump into it and tell you guys one or two about it um the products used during the fall season is number one um the colors of your of your makeups you need these vibrant colors like the orange the light brown the dark brown the yellow the dusty pink the gray and so many this product is that the lipstick used during the fall season um the products of lipstick is um moist it has to be moist then it has to be colorful um you can wear as much contour or blush that you want than necessary um there is less mascara during the fall season i must tell you that as going to my research you need less of the mascara so let's go over and cut this crease and get this makeup done with and so guys i'm going to cut my crease and go over with the rest of the makeup um and i'll be showing you guys the rest the final look later on 
um, for the palette that I used, I used Morphe Tat 5M palette and Tat 5A palette, then the Magic by Julia's Place palette. I'm going to take my red shade right here. With this i've never tried this um glitter <gasps> glitter eyeliner brown i want to try it today And this is the final look guys. Thank you so much for watching my tutorials today. Please don't forget to hit that subscribe button and don't forget to hit the like button and don't forget to get, let me know what you think about the video in the comment box down below and I'll be seeing you guys in my next video. Thank you.